Hello everybody. Today we will be learning internal and external parts of our body. So let's start. Our body is made up of different parts and these parts work together to keep us fit and healthy. We can see some parts of our body while some parts we cannot see and depends on this we can classify our body parts into two types the body parts which we can see with our eyes are called external body parts internal body parts are the body parts which we cannot see with our eyes and they are inside our body so there are two types of body parts external and internal eyes nose legs arms feet fingers these are external body parts lungs stomach kidneys these are internal body parts let's see one by one sense organs do you remember sense organs in previous chapter we have already learned a lot about sense organs eyes nose ear skin and tongue these are five sense organs all the sense organs are external parts of the body and so we can see them eyes we use our eyes to see when our eyes are open they constantly take picture of the world around us and that picture they send it to our brain and our brain store that picture so that in future we can remember the same thing which we have seen we can see different colors things people and places around us with the help of our eyes we can see the beautiful world around us with the help of our eyes we use our nose to smell through smell we can tell the difference between a rose flower and a garbage so we can say that fragrance of rose is a good smell and the stinking smell of a dustbin is a bad smell tongue we use our tongue to taste it help us to know the different taste like sweet spicy sour bitter and salt these are the different type of food which we eat and enjoy with the help of our tongue here we hear different sounds with our ears chirping of birds honking of cars or if someone is talking or shouting or a beautiful music these all sounds we can hear with the help of our ears skin the skin help us to feel we can feel things that are hot or cold with the help of our skin with the help of skin you can also tell if something is rough or soft or if something is wet or dry this was all about external body parts all the sense organs as well as our hands leg arms these all are the external body parts the body parts which we can see with our eyes are external body parts now we will learn about few of the internal body parts some of the internal body parts are brain heart lungs stomach and kidneys these are the main body parts internal body parts of our body let's learn about them 
वन बाय वन ब्रेन अवर ब्रेन इज इन अवर हेड इट हेल्प अस टू थिंक इट कंट्रोल्स ऑल अदर पार्ट्स ऑफ अवर बॉडी इट आल्सो कंट्रोल्स अवर थॉट मेमोरी इमोशन टच विजन ब्रीदिंग टेंपरेचर हंगर एंड एवरी प्रोसेस दैट रेगुलेट्स अवर बॉडी लंग्स वी हैव टू लंग्स the lungs are in our chest they help us to purify the air we breathe in the lungs and respiratory system allows us to breathe they bring oxygen into our bodies and send carbon dioxide out this exchange of oxygen and carbon dioxide is called respiration and so lungs do a very important function for us they purify the air which we breathe in heart the heart is located to the left of our chest do you know we have two lungs and the left side lung of our body is a bit smaller than the lung on the right this extra space on the left side leaves room for the heart and this is where heart is located the size of heart is as small as the size of our closed fist the heart sends blood around our body the blood provides our body with the oxygen and nutrients which is required for our body it also carries away waste our heart is a sort of like a pump or two pumps it pumps blood to all parts of our body stomach the food we eat goes into the stomach here the food is digested The main job of stomach is to store and break down the food which we eat so that it can be digested. Kidney. We have two kidneys, one on the left side and one on the right side. They filter the waste out of our blood as a urine. Kidneys filter the blood and take out all the waste in the blood the kidneys send the waste onto the bladder in the form of urine our body is also made up of bones and muscles the bones give shape to the body and help us stand straight look at the image this is how a bone structure looks it is called as skeleton different bones in our body are attached to each other with the help of joints joints allow our body to move in different ways look at your elbows and knees when you bend your elbows and knees your joints move they help us to move the different parts or different bones in our body muscles are attached to the bones and they help us to run to play to work and to study and to do different activities in our life so children this was all about the different parts of our body today we learned about internal parts and external parts of our body external parts are the parts which we can see with our eyes internal parts of our body are inside our body they are located inside the body and so we cannot see them this is how all the parts of the body help us to breathe to digest and to do different activities in next lesson 
we will learn some another topic till then bye bye